going on everybody? Ray Jr. coming live from the laundry room once again. Uh, the video I am uh, showing you is my first haul for 2017. Uh, I got one LCS haul. Uh, I didn't do the video for that one because it was just one book. So it was kind of pointless uh, just to show one book. Uh, I'm going to try to minimize my videos as in just wait till I get a bulk in. And that way I'm not, you know, wasting your time watching like a two minute video or whatnot. Uh, excuse me real quick. Yeah, I had to crack open a, a cold one. Uh, it's been one of those uh, days. I've been uh, in my boxes searching for um, Power Girl Volume 1. Uh, I have uh, number one uh, I bought off eBay graded and it was signed by Jerry Conway. But I found my issue, my own issue 1 and 2. But now I'm looking for 3 and 4 and my stuff is just scattered everywhere. I don't have them organized right now, so I'm thinking my next duty station, uh, I'm going to take some time to do that. So that way I know where everything's at. Now, I know where all my Thor's at. Uh, don't, don't worry about that. I know where all those are at. But just the, the onesies and twosies that I need to either put in order or start making a box for uh, me to downsize. I got over 6,600 comics. And now that I'm actually looking at my collection, I'm thinking some of the stuff I don't even need. You know, I think I was just buying them just to be buying books and, you know, getting caught up with the hype of the variants and all that. Which, you know, there's nothing wrong with the variants. I know they're a little pricey or whatever, but just trying to collect all those. And like I said, just, uh, I got a lot of stuff that was given to me. My first deployment, like over 200 books. Um, so... Like I said, I, I just need to start getting rid of them. Maybe do like uh, my, my partner Marty's doing, like, uh, you know, get a dollar bin or whatever. Um, or I might not do no video, man. I'll just post that, hey, here's what I got, a dollar. You know, you know, the, uh, I could say maybe I'll give it the books a grade as a fair. So that way when you get it, you could be the judge. It might be better. So I'm just give it the lowest grade possible. So that way you're not, um, the person's not uh, anticipating like a, a, a fine or, you know, or near men or whatever. Because like I said, some of these books, you know, was given to me. It came from over. Uh, I was in uh, Afghanistan. So, you know, the traveling and then me having to make sure they get back, try, you know, trying to make sure they're good to go. So that that's what my plan is. You know, there's nothing wrong with getting rid of uh, your books to try to get the books that you actually want and that's the, I think that's the theme uh, this year I know me and Marty's talked about that a lot you know and I know some of the guys I've talked with on the off air uh, you know get you know getting rid of stuff that you really don't want you know you're collecting to get stuff that you actually need so that's what I'm gonna do like I said once I get after I graduate from school June 23rd and I get settled in then maybe just have my wife and kids go somewhere so that way uh, I can have that whole weekend to organize you know, all my books, uh, make sure I know where they're at, writing on the boxes, okay, this is what's in here, and then the ones I know I'm not keeping once I go through my CLZ list, the, I'm going to just get rid of them, okay, a dollar, blah, 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 you know, so, if I have to go from 6,000 to 3,000 comics, then that's what it is, but then I know that's about over $3,000 that I've earned, and I can, you know, get what I need as in more either my books that are already you know that I have getting a, a better copy as in like how I've been doing with the Thor and getting it either already graded or with the signature and graded so you know I like that too but I'm not going to keep you uh, that, that's four minutes right there so take a little sip of that and we'll go ahead and begin okay the first book I'm going to show you is what I got at my LCS on January 1st this is a 5.5 of Thor 130. Uh, it's a Hercules and Pluto uh, appearance. So, like I said, I had, well, you already know I have all these. It's just, I'm just trying to get, you know, either better copies, you know, or graded ones. Because that, at the end, that, that's, my, that's my goal, is to get all my Thor books graded. Next, this is what I got in the mail yesterday. So, Christmas, it seemed like it was Christmas yesterday. When I got all these packages, but we're going to start with uh, Thor God of Thunder 1. As you see, this is a cover by Joe Quesada. I hope I didn't butcher his name, but it's a 
Quesada uh, variant cover. Uh, sorry about the glare. I don't know what. The, uh, yeah, nothing I can really do about that. I guess. Sorry about that. And then we have the Quesada sketch cover. So it's pretty much just black and white. So I got a, a good deal on both of these. I mean, 125 for both of these total. Next up, in a brand new case, uh, I don't collect Justice League, but everybody knows I love my Power Girl, so I had to get this cover. Look at that, just she on the front anyway, and just put out right there. And like I said, it's the new case. You got the the well, you know how it's got that lip back there. So. And I, you know, like I said before, I, I, I like the new cases. It seem pretty more sturdy. They, you know, a lot better than the old ones. I think, you know, the um, the the content um, uh, stands out a little bit better. So that way, you know, it's not kind of blurry or whatever to me. Uh, I guess I should already had this out the bag. Next up is another Thor book. Here we have Thor uh, three thirty nine. This is a better rate bill appearance. So more like his third appearance. It's a nine point new, so near mint minus. But it's signed by Alt Simonson. So Simonson did an amazing, amazing run on uh, the Thor books in the 80s. The, I want to say the mid, yeah, like mid 80s. So I was a... I was all up on those Thor books back in the day. Man, you know, then duty calls the army and lost lost touch with all that stuff and I had to start my collection all over again. So you can just say 2000, yeah, 2000 is when I started collecting comics back over again after starting in 79. My dad got my first issue of Thor 282. And just so just say it took me 16 years to get that whole run. Uh here we go with uh, Thor, Son of Asgard, number two. It's like one of those other uh, offside stories of Thor, which that's what I'm working on getting now. All those little like one shots and six issue series or four issue series. So that way I can't say, you know, I do have the whole Thor collection. I just have the whole run of his one title. But now I'm working on all the, the short stories. So 9-8, uh, pretty good. I got this one for... If you count shipping, 30 bucks. And I'm gonna have to change the bag out. Good thing I bought some bags that'll fit these cases right here. Alright, next up is uh let me get the head off of there. Is a Thor God of Thunder 1. And this is a sketch edition, and this is done by Ronald Villa on uh, 1 January, so 2016. This is lovely. Oh my gosh. When I saw this, I had to get it. Had to get it. I had some stuff that I sold on eBay. And I was like, yeah, I'm buying that. So I ended up paying $149 for this one. $149. So, so I'm going to go ahead and sit that right there. So, But that is it. That is the video. I know this is a Saturday. I know everybody's probably busy. I know my man Marty in probably about like 30 minutes is going to be doing his uh, live dollar auction for a lot of his books. Because like I said, he's downsizing as well, uh, like myself. So just let me know what you think about uh, the video. Like I said, sorry about the glare. I, I, I'll have to try to fix that. Yeah, I probably won't have uh, a good handle on that until like I get my get my own man room instead of you know using the wife's laundry room or whatever because you know I gotta move stuff over to the left to the right side so you're not seeing all this craziness her, her little pillow she likes decorating it and all that stuff but other than that I hope everybody has a great weekend I know next weekend is uh, Martin Luther King weekend so uh, I know everybody's probably stoked for that that you know my, my regular civilian buddies that might get you know that day off I know I'll be having Friday Saturday Sunday and Monday off so uh, Another nice little break. Uh, I should be graduating. That shit. That's this stuff's gonna go by quick. So before you know it, I'll be graduating. 
So I'll try to make a video of that, me walking across the stage and all that, and that'll be on my personal YouTube channel. It won't be on the comic book fanatics page, but I'll put it on my my YouTube channel. That's where I normally put like uh, you know stuff I do with the family, you know stuff with biscuit, you know, and you know my personal stuff right there. So like I said, until next time, I'm out.